What's up, homies? I hope everybody's having a beautiful day today. Yes, you can probably tell by the sound of my voice. I'm a little under the weather, but it's okay. I still have my sense of smell and taste, so I'm assuming it's not the, the, the thing. So I, I believe it's just allergies, and we're here to have a good time. Because you know what day it is? It's One Piece Day! That's right. Being sick can't stop the best days of the week. <laughs> We're going to be hopping into episode 95, 96, and 97. Uh, currently, guys, on the YouTube community tab, I do have a poll running on uh, whether you want to see episodes uh, 98 and 99. Uh, right now, it's vastly no, because those are considered filler episodes. And uh, that being said, I'm probably going to react to those live on Twitch, and we will also just make those Patreon exclusive. Uh, that being said, probably with... Uh, episode 100. I don't know if I'm going to make that a solo singular episode since that's like a Luffy cosplay episode, or if I'm just going to look really, really stupid for three episodes. So uh, we'll just have to see, but uh, I'm excited to hop into this. I want to see more Ace. Hopefully uh, we get more Ace Luffy interaction going forward. Uh, we were, you know, the, the, the straw hats were running away last we saw as Smoker and Ace were about to get into a, a, a gnarly brawl. So I'm very excited to see where these episodes go. But as always, Make sure you help feed the algorithm monster, baby. Hit that subscribe button down below. Give us a thumbs up. Hit us with a comment. And of course, share the show with your friends. Grow the Boom Squad stronger. And I can't thank you guys enough for the support. Uh, that being said, if you want to see this completely unedited, uncut, all the unthings, make sure you go to patreon.com forward slash boomstick and uh, do the thing there. We got a, we got a bus, bussin. I was about to say a burgeoning or busting uh patreon community and and it just kind of came out bussing so it you know that's a that's a word on tiktok now the bussing community <laughs> that's yeah i i you know i'm i'm on a little bit of medicine right now so it's fine i can just i can either cut this out and post or i can leave it in here and just blame it on on the medicine anywho super excited to hop into these episodes let's do it guys 95 96 and 97 there we go, right into the title screen. No reading the title. That's the rules. I have a crystal ball and a witch to tell me otherwise if you guys read them. You're kicked out of the community. Left alone in a one-piece wasteland. Oh, yeah. I don't know if this is going to be a full-fledged fight, but if it is, I am ready for it. Oh! Ah, oh, you can just smell the Burger King fumes off that. Oh, man. Let's see how it goes. I love you can, like, so low-key, like, right there, you can see in, like, in, like, you can still see Ace. At, at least I assume that's Ace, like, right there. I think that's such a cool touch. Oh, yo. I am not mad at this right now. Is the house on fire? <laughs> Dude, that's just a straight up smoke flame tornado. So I wonder what Ace's relationship to Shanks is. Since Shanks seemed kind of like a mentor to Luffy. Like, was he the same for Ace? Oh, oh my God. Well, let's hope. Let's hope no one gets hurt. Uh oh, and Luffy got separated. Goodbye. Oh my God. Oh God. And we don't have our captain. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably the loudest voice there that you don't that you don't have currently. Yo! All right, we are gonna get some brother time. Oh, 
Oh. Uh. Oh, yo, we're going right into arm wrestling? Okay. A hundred watermelons? Shoo! <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Oh! I enjoy that they actually... I actually like that right there. So immediately it sets them on equal footing uh, in case there were ever a fight. I don't know if, if, if they ever go at it. Um, for any particular reason, but that that already physically, like physically, strength wise, we know Luffy is like so far pretty far ahead almost everyone else on the Going Merry, except for maybe you know San Sanji's out there. I'm not sure like in in relation to strength, uh, whether he's close to Luffy. Like Zoro's very strong as well, but immediately this this puts Ace on Luffy's level, which I like. So it automatically shows he's gone up against Smoker, did well. He's gone up against Luffy, did well. So we know how strong Ace is now. Also, somebody made a good point in the comments uh, about uh, the only day it didn't snow on Drum Island was the day Ace was there. <clears throat> so I'm guessing with a tattoo that beard, he's probably a pretty hardcore dude. I wonder if he's as fearsome as Blackbeard. I'm guessing Homeboy is not ever going to become part of the uh, Straw Hats. Luffy's like, that's because you ain't been on my ship, son. Oh. We might get a fight after all then. I, I could be wrong. <laughs> Nice. Uh oh. <laughs> He's like, dang, why we here? That would be crazy that that would be a job in constant flux of people wanting to kill other people to get that seat. Oh! Yo! Okay. So, uh, that's the kind of thing I wanted to point out. Like, in my head, I'm kind of imagining doing, like, a One Piece review, like, the first hundred episodes. And I want to talk about how uh, things like that, like, totally subvert the way the show looks and, like, the overall vibe. Where you have so much happiness and, like, big, like, big emotional moments. Uh, you know, usually mostly on the positive side. Where I remember, you know, it's like early on with like uh, Shanks' crew where they shoot that guy in the head. Like I knew then that this this was a different kind of show. And now when they like continue to do stuff like that, then it it, it shows that like, you know, it's a it's a it's a mostly positive show, but they have some dark moments. <laughs> <clears throat> Yo, getting a musician would be dope. Okay, that's more dudes than I was really expecting for the fight, but you know what? Screw it. <clears throat> I mean, he does have his hands full respectfully right now. Oh! That's a lot of dudes. I think the last time he encountered this many people in a fight, he was uh, just walking by them casually to go to the bathroom after eating too much. <laughs> uh, when you're when you're such a limited threat, they just keep walking during your villain speech. Dude, they're not even paying attention to them. It's like, when did these dudes get here? Oh. Nice. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh! Man said, okay. Oh! That's dope. Uh-oh. <laughs> Dude, it looks like he just went down one of those Olympic ski jumps. They say anybody else want some? You can follow behind. Yeah, I'd be I'd be trying to I'd be trying to make my nut on something else. Uh I would go ahead and let them walk to their ship. <clears throat> The, he's like, I'm just going to go ahead and leave, dude. <laughs> Is he going to latch on to Zoro like always? Oh, nope. There we go. He's always got to knock somebody down, though. Wait, wait, wait. Did his thing bust into a... Oh, yeah. Like it jumped into a giant question mark. Amazing. Oh, yo, that would come in handy. Uh-oh. Who's that on the other side coming through? No, oh, poor Chopper. Oh, damn. All right. It's the Baroque guys. Oh, yo, I need that scene in a video game like now. Oh, my God. Okay, he's pretty good. I mean, he's okay, I guess. Oh. Dude is a beast. Oh my god. Smoker's like, am I losing my touch? <clears throat> that one, hmm. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> so much for that I don't drink thing oh it'd be really cool if he did oh the black beard versus white beard I'm about it Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Even when it's not needed, my man's is still simping. Dude, yeah, I'm ready to see Ace in action more. Dear god, that was that scene was I was going to say lit, but that's a little too on the nose. All right, that was a really good freaking episode, man. I'm glad that they we're doing a little bit, a little bit of back, back world building with uh, uh, the brotherly bond between Luffy and Ace. Also, it was good to see how strong Ace actually is with the the arm wrestling thing. And oh man, I hope Smoker like, I want Smoker to like be the one to solve the case in the sense of like he doesn't like Crocodile already. Uh, he hates the Warlords. So I, I, I feel like this is a case where he could quickly become an ally just as much as a hindrance. And I, I definitely the former instead of the latter. Let's fingers crossed. But 
Anyway, let's get on to episode 96. All right, guys, episode 96. Let's do the thing. Hmm. These people look serious. Oh. Oh, that ain't good. Uh-oh, is it going to be Crocodile? Is he going to feed the people? Oh, no, it is the king. Damn. Man's meeting up with the people. Respect. Damn, he looks serious. Dude. Oh. Actual man of the people? As a king should. Ooh, those dudes look like they can fight. So I wonder if we're going to get to meet them later on. Also, is homeboy with the powder eventually going to be like a hero? Damn, can Ace cook as well? Full package, homie. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, I wish I hope Karu and Vivi are like around for a long while. He said, what? <laughs> it's like choppers in the back. Only one understanding was like, he is not happy. Yo, let's go, dude. Well, obviously, he needed to stop to take a sip. It's hot out there. Dude, Karu's... Like, the animals on One Piece are always big homies. I mean, we've seen it happen before. With a... With a... Ah... Uh, Dude, I forgot his name. Swinging Glove Man. <laughs> Kura? Aw, oh, man. Now I'm going to be driven crazy until I remember this dude's name. Kuro. Yes. Yeah, he was Cloudor. I was, I was mostly right. Well, that's, that's not morbid at all. They're all dead. I guess that's why they're called the Billions. Yes. 
I love, so like, it's very understated, but like Chopper being able to communicate with a uh, animals has completely opened up like so many things. It's like, it's like open, opening up new dialogue choices in an RPG. Like there's so many ways the story can go now because like now they can add animals to like the actual plot. I love that. Uh-oh. Usopp gonna get his ass whooped. <laughs> uh, facts. Oh, bless him. He said, all right, fam, you got my respect. Oh, God. Well, now he's got his own little small army. Oh, my God. Possibly the best moment in the entire show. Oh, Chopper, the new hero of the Dugongs. <laughs> Oh my god. A loving and peaceful people, those dugongs. Dude. And they got they 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 got a drum line. Uh-oh. Oh shit. That town is devastated, dude. Oh. It used to be the town. Uh, it was Yuba. City of Green? Oh, like them or not, but they are good at their job. Damn, that's crazy. Dude, like seeing like places in severe drought is like some of the saddest things ever, man. Was it? I was like, was it the powder? Oh, shit. Yeah, they've already said, like, the world, was it World Organization or whatever, have said that it's, uh... It's like against the law. I don't. I don't think he ever said why it was like illegal. Did they? <laughs> he said, "Yeah, I learned that." Exactly. Uh oh. Oh, so like it actually draws ring. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Once again, One Piece hitting us with some Dr. Stone-esque science. Okay, now that's completely understandable. It's like Gabriel's horn. What do we do, big brother? <laughs> 
Oh my god, that's even... Dude. Could you imagine being in a town like that? Being that creepy? Oh. Yo. That's incredibly sad. Oh, that's incredibly scary. Oh, yeah. Could this be Crocodile's power? I mean, it is kind of his shtick. Uh-huh. Oh, that's so cool. Is everyone accounted for? Oh, dude, that power is just so effing gnarly. I also said that he was a Peter Pan reference, and someone was telling me he was actually supposed to be more like the Riddler with the hook looking like a question mark. Oh, well, hello. Dude. Say it's about to pop off. It's like, dude, you you know, like when they play in this music too, it's marching music. Like we 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 on our way to whoop someone's ass. Oh, that was a good episode right there, man. Uh, more of a uh, like, yeah, kind of like a backstory building episode, which One Piece does those really really well. Like One Piece and Attack on Titan both uh, do those kind of episodes really well, where it's just like just it it, it starts like filling in the blanks of the overall story. Uh, that way, it's just like one big continuity, like to the next big moment. So, uh, the fact that we learned that it, it wasn't uh, the king that was actually using the powder, uh, it was actually Crocodile planning it and doing it. And the whole time, I guess the king thinking, like, hey, like we're just so blessed in this area. Um, and I love that they explained the science of the powder itself. So now, now we fully understand why, why it's outlawed because, like, somewhere else has to be in a drought for it to work. So, on to episode 97. Let's do it. All right, guys. Episode 97. I'm also loving that we're, like, getting this graph taking us through. Feels so interactive. All right. We are going to... Do I need to fast forward this? There we go. There we go. No reading the title. That's the rule. The, the cold medicine running through my body gives me a sixth sense of knowing if you guys read the title. An exasperated Luffy can be heard through the desert. <laughs> That's true. Dude, that was me last night when I first started getting sick. And I was like, you know, got that man flu. It's just like, oh, man. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even think of that. He is coming from Drum Island. <laughs> oh my god. The strength of Zoro pushing Chopper back down into baby size. Dude, she's from here. Yeah, I was like... It's like I went to Arizona one time. Uh, that's where the wife is from. And like the dry heat out there. It was like... 
115 degrees feels like 80 degrees in the south. So it's like, because there's like no humidity. It was like easy peasy out there. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, but now he's wasting it. And this is how the Civil War started on uh, Alabasta. I wonder if Ace is just used to this kind of heat because of his body temp. <laughs> Poor Sanji. He's a simp, but also when he cooks food, he has to act as chef and babysitter. I'm like the antithesis of that. I drive people away. It's a gift. <laughs> God, they do like the still images so well in this. That is not a shrimp, buddy. A desert shrimp. Oh my god. Vivi, you might want to get out here and help these men. <laughs> he said, fine then. Uh oh, was he here? This st I'm still wondering if this is like crocodile just like ruining their time, or if this is just the elements. Oh, okay, pretty devastating. I love how unfazed he is, like, 98% of the time. <clears throat> She's like, we ain't halfway there, there yet, homie. <laughs> Uso said that's my job it's gonna be him right Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. Uh Because he's a monster. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't be trusting these sounds. Are they people? Oh. Well, that just makes me sad. Uh-oh. Yeah, Vivi, you want to give us like a chart of the land or something? 
<laughs> Yo, that's awesome, actually, though. It's like those little piano playing monkeys, like you see like in other countries that like pickpocket people. It's time to eat chopper. <laughs> yeah, they'll eventually get tired. Dude, once again, Zoro, like in that 90s rapper fit, said, Respect the drip, Karen. Welp. Woo. Say so what now? Oh. Yo, Vivi should have hit us with like the Steve Irwin freaking blueprint of this world. I told you, this is a place like Australia. Oh, camel bro. <laughs> Yo, let's go. <laughs> I love how it's just like a foregone conclusion that like he's going to get lost like that and they're just cool with it. They're just like, yeah, whatever. It happens. He's like that sometimes. Oh my God. Is he writing it back? Whatever it is. Him and Cam oh no, him and Camel Bro are running away from it. ha. <laughs> right on okay <laughs> i cannot wait oh my god i was gonna say i can't wait to see what this thing is it's a beast oh that thing will make for good eating for a long time all right then fair enough <laughs> so Zoro's the one sitting there, typical Pisces. Yo, let's go. When the boys go hunting. Delicious. Ah, uh, I love that they're the big three. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, I think we found the wife. <clears throat> yeah, Vivi's forgetting to mention a lot once again. Ace is already going to grill it up. Ah, oh, I've also had acid reflux. Dude, and that's a chunk of meat. <coughs> Excuse me.
Uh, yeah, the saddle. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say the saddle gives that away. Yeah, it's Camel Bro. Oh my god. Camel said no cover for the ladies. Damn, we found Sanji in camel form. <laughs> pervy camel. Well, I guess Pervy Camel is now taking over for Camel Bro. Yeah, especially since VV won't tell us everything that's here. Nice. Oh, okay. Yo, good way to end things right there. Camel pervy bro. Pervy camel bro. There we go. That's the one. Coming in clutch at the very end. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this One Piece Day. Once again, best days of the week. I, I love where this is going. Uh, Alabasta so far has been like a pretty rich story, especially like when they're filling in like the little plot points. Uh, really enjoy these episodes. I hope you did too. I feel like uh, I, I am going to start like kind of making like more guesses towards the end of these episodes as well uh, about what I feel like might happen. Um, and and it's, it's one of those things that I, I feel like Bone Clay is going to come into play uh, at some point since he does have the face of the king. Uh, so I'm, I'm just expecting that at any moment now, especially like when Baroque Works uh, final plan gets put into play. Uh, and yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see where it goes. You know what else I'm excited for? When you guys feed the algorithm monster, baby, hit that subscribe button down below. Give us the thumbs up. Of course, hit us with a comment, share the show with your friends, bring them into the boom squad as we grow stronger. And of course you want to see these unedited, uncut, unmuted, all the uns, make sure you go to patreon.com forward slash boomstick for real guys. Thank you so much for taking this ride with me. I greatly appreciate it. I love your faces. Be the joy.